what do I do if I want to apply for a borrower defense to repayment under the sweet settlement? Well, the sweet settlement is for certain student loan borrowers who attended certain for-profit schools and applied for what's called a borrower defense to repayment to cancel some or all their student loans. And they made this application before June 22nd, 2022. The settlement says that if you make an application even after June 22nd, 2022, but before the final settlement is scheduled to be approved, sometime around November 3rd of 2022, you could still benefit by getting your student loans canceled in whole or in part. So here's an example. A borrower takes out federal student loans to attend certain for-profit schools, but they couldn't find meaningful employment or transfer the credits they earned at that school to a different school, but they're still stuck paying back the student loans. What can they do? They can apply to cancel some or all those student loans under this settlement. However, if they haven't applied yet, and this is what I was talking about a minute ago, then they have to apply before the court gives the final approval to the settlement, which as I said, is supposed to be November 3rd, 2022. First thing you need to do, and you need to do it as soon as you get done watching this video, is go to studentaid.gov. Update your email and your snail mail contact information at that website. You log in, update that info there. If you don't have an account at studentaid.gov, then the first thing you need to do is create an account and then put in that account your current contact information with your email and your mailing address, which is your snail mail contact information. And then once you've done that, you just need to make sure that everything else that the website that that account has will put you in a position to get that borrower defense to repayment and then you can get some or part of some or all of your student loans from when you went to that for-profit school canceled.